Okay, so uh, we have two more questions. This first one integrand is e power tan inverse x over 1 plus x square multiply by inside bracket. Here we have uh, uh, two inverse trigonometric functions. We have square of second inverse root 1 plus x square plus cos inverse of uh, 1 minus x square over 1 plus x square. Now, here uh, we will be using some formulas of inverse trigonometric functions. Using formulas, uh, we can simplify uh, these two functions. Straight away, what is cos inverse 1 minus x square over 1 plus x square? Consa formula dhyan uh, mein This is straight away 2 tan inverse x. Take it up. Check it out. 2 tan inverse x. How do we derive it? We put x is equal to tan theta. So, we have 1 minus tan square theta over 1 plus tan square theta which is cos 2 theta cos inverse of cos 2 theta is 2 theta. Okay? Not always but for timing we have to consider 2 theta where theta is tan inverse x. So, this is 2 tan inverse x. Okay? We are given that x is greater than 0. When x is greater than 0, uh, theta belongs to open interval 0 to pi by 2. So, 2 theta belongs to open interval 0 to pi which falls uh, within the range of cos inverse function. Okay? So, we can write cos inverse of cos 2 theta as 2 theta. We can write it here because x is condition given. Hai, hai na? Now, second inverse root 1 plus x square is tan inverse x. If we put x is equal to tan theta, 1 plus tan square theta is second square theta, uh, whose square root is uh, second theta. Okay, because uh, x is positive, root of second square theta will be second theta. And second inverse of second theta is theta, where theta is uh, tan inverse x. So, we have here square of tan inverse. Take it up. Okay, now, here we have e power tan inverse x and inside bracket we have two terms uh, having function tan inverse x. So, what we do? We put here tan inverse x is equal to t. Okay. So, we have 1 over 1 plus x square dx is equal to dt. Okay. So, integral i becomes e power t dx upon 1 plus x square is dt. Okay. And this is t square, this is 2t. So, we have inside bracket t square plus 2t. Okay. So, now we have integration of function e power t multiplied by t square plus 2t. 2t is derivative of t square. So, this is e power t multiplied by t square, where t is equal to tan inverse x. Take it in. So, here uh, this is very nice question. Uh, we have concepts of uh, inverse trigonometric functions. We are using some formulas, in fact, elementary formulas of inverse trigonometric functions, which help us to understand uh, what should be the substitution. We have tan inverse x ko t. Rakha, na? Now, look at this integral. We have integration of e power cortex upon sin square x multiply by inside bracket 2 log cos x plus sin 2x. Now, one thing you should be aware of this thing is that 1 upon sin square x is cos x square x hai, and cos x square x is actually derivative of minus cortex. And definitely here, substitution will be uh, cortex is equal to t. Okay. So, we put cot x is equal to t. Okay. Then we have uh, minus cos x square x dx is equal to dt. Okay. So, we have i is equal to e power t dx upon sin square x means uh, cos x square x uh, dx is minus dt. Okay. And inside bracket we have uh, okay now how can we write sin 2x in the form of function cortex. Sin 2x is uh, 2 tan x over 1 plus 10 square x. Okay. Now, we divide numerator and denominator by 
uh, 10 square x. So, we have uh, 2 cot x over cot square x plus 1. Thick in a cot x is t. So, sin 2 x is 2 t over 1 plus t square. Thick in now, 2t upon 1 plus t square is derivative of uh, log of 1 plus t square. Ye jo hai, wo is function ka derivative hai na. To yahan pe definitely hume ye function milna chahiye. We must get this function here. We will get that 2 log of cos x is log of cos square x. Thik hai? We can use here property of uh, logarithm. Now, cos x square x is 1 plus cot square x and cot x is t. So, we have here log of 1 plus t square. Jo hume chahiye tha, wo mil gaya yaha pe. Thikhe? Now, this is function and this is its derivative. So, this is minus e power t multiply by log of 1 plus t square plus constant c. Now, in this put t is equal to cot x. So, here we have some substitution techniques. Let us try one more equation. Okay. Now, here we have one very interesting equation. We have function e power x power 4 multiply by inside bracket x plus x cube plus 2 x power 5 multiply by e power x square. Now, definitely here we will use substitution technique. Kya substitute karenge? We have here even powers of x, x power 4, x square and inside bracket we have odd powers of x. Ye kuch odd hai, thik hai na? Kuch uh, ajeeb sa hai. Kya kar sakte hai? We can get x common from this bracket. So, inside bracket we have 1 plus x square plus 2 x power 4. This multiply by e power x square multiply by x dx and here we have e power x power 4. Now, we let x square is equal to t. So, this will be dt upon 2. Take it From this we will get 2 x dx is equal to dt. So, x dx will be dt upon 2. So, here integral i becomes e power t square multiply by 1 plus t plus 2 t square multiply by e power t multiply by x dx is dt upon 2. Okay. So, we have here 1 upon 2 multiply by integration of uh, this function. Now, our aim is to write uh, this function as uh, e power t multiply by f of t plus f prime t. We is form mein rakhna hai, is function ko. Then definitely, we are going to multiply e power t square inside bracket, but smartly. So, that we get f of t plus f prime t. Kaise multiply karenge? We have t multiply by e power t square plus e power t square multiply by 1 plus 2 t square. Okay. Now, purpose of writing like this is that I am assuming that if this is function f of t, then this is its derivative. Thoda hame hit and trial to karna padega. Let us check derivative of t multiplied by e power t square. We have derivative 1 multiplied by e power t square plus t multiplied by 2t multiplied by e power t square. Take e power t square common inside bracket, we get 1 plus 2t square, which is there. Okay. So, this is f of t, then this is its derivative. So, this is equal to 1 upon 2 multiplied by e power t multiplied by t multiplied by e power t square. Put t is equal to x square, we get uh, 1 upon 2 multiplied by e power x square multiplied by x square multiplied by e power x power 4 plus constant c. So, this is very nice question. Here we have uh, least integration and uh, maximum uh, differentiation. Okay, right? 